this moment, he knew he messed up. down to the top acts. It's the final. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Jay Norris to the stage. Hey, this company has come a long way since we started it in my parents' pool house in East Caraway. Today, you're about to witness a new phase full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination. We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain, and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world, an average age of only 14.4 years. That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary. Today, right here, we are about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal... Oh, hold on a second. I think someone's trying to talk with me. Hello? Hello? Oh! Ah, dirty. Oh, Jesus! Whoa! Oh, no, 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 That's... no, 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 That was heavy. Are you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know, the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Dad. Jimbo. Actually, it's Jizzo. Hey, son. Hey, Pop. Jimmy. Loser. Hey, Jim. Hey, Dad. I love you, son. Whatever you say, Dad. James? Father? Jimbo. Actually, it's Jizzo.
Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Dad. Come in, Michael. Uh, yeah, thanks, Doc. How have you been? Oh, good. Things been good. No, actually, things ain't been good. Things been a far fucking way from good. I've been uh, acting out. That's what you would call it, I think, right? Acting out. So what exactly has been the problem? I'm not good, Doc. Not good at all. I'm sorry to hear that. Tell me. I just... I've been caught up in the bullshit, Doc. You know, ever since I pulled this Mexican's house off a hill, it's been nothing but killing and robbing. I mean, I hooked up with this old associate. I even got a new one, too, this kid. With, I don't know, he's got similar proclivities. Uh, you know? Oh, God. Now everything's out of control. I mean, but it's not by choice. You know, I just... My life just got away from me. That sounds a lot like denial, Michael. This is really worrying. So, any other violent urges, friend? Yeah, I mean, I've had good days, Doc, but mostly they've just been really bad days. I've been doing really bad things, you know, hurting people. You're a very sick man, Michael. I'm doing all I can, but we need more sessions. Everyone makes mistakes. I'm not trying to be perfect. Okay. And what about your sexual behaviors? I got real lonely, so I picked up a girl. You know how it is. It didn't help. I still hate myself. I don't feel sorry for you. I feel concerned you can't manage your emotions better. I just ain't myself right now, Doc. Not since my life went crazy. You're plainly addicted to chaos. 
Well, I'm not sure that's true, Doc. <laughs> I'm not exactly enjoying myself here. You know, what I'm addicted to is not getting killed. But for some reason, I keep getting my ass into situations where getting killed is a little hard to avoid. What about the people you kill? Well, yeah, but that's not for fun. Are you sure? What exactly are you asking, Doc? Am I a psychopath who enjoys suffering? Or a sociopath who doesn't give a flying fuck about the rules? Come on, we've already had this conversation, right? I'm neither. I'm just a fat, washed-up jock who can't get his head around the fact that his high school football career didn't play out the way that he planned. The only way I'm content and, and competent is with a gun in my hand or a price on my head. You're very defensive, Michael. Do you consider yourself a failure? I pay you to listen to my problems. I'm rich, I'm miserable. I mean, half the time my kids can't stand me, the other half my wife is cheating on me. I kill people without remorse, Doc. I'm pretty average for this town, really. Wait a minute, that's the shot. I, I, I think I'm having a breakthrough here, Doc. This, I think, no, no, I know that I'm just terrified that I'm I'm sure gonna... you are, but that's really all we have time for. <sighs> See you next time. Okay.
Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. Oh, <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do's your business, bro. Anyway, Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought, maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. on a vehicle in uh, South Pacific Bluff. Some bad drivers, but you! Woo -hoo -hoo.
the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. Shh, shh, shh. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. Hasn't been yet. Look. I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in L.S. or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. The jeweler's is on Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business? FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, maybe they thought this would be the best cuff. Most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Okay, let's get this done. You reading me? Mm-hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Sir, thank you. Excuse me. Alarms, you. vents, cameras, remember? The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. All right, I got an idea of their CCTV setup. Uh, can you shoot an air vent in the alarm keypad? Still need the alarm and the ventilation. What's this of? Fuck all! So, uh, that's the cameras and the alarm, and when you've got a shot of the vents, we're done. Alright, that's the ventilation. Good work. Now speak to the assistant, and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. But one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. 
So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm gonna take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. Have a wonderful day. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Let's hurry this up, Michael. Hello, this is 911. What emergency service do you require? Thank you. Paramedics are en route to your current location. Ha <laughs> ha! 